Cartris Deda, Mother Georgia, 20 perfect meters of aluminum. You are so beautiful in your traditional Georgian garb. I assure you, I am a friend, not a foe. Take down your sword and guide me through the streets of Tbilisi, that I might wrap my lips around some sacred khachapuri, grind my teeth on some divine khinkali, soak my tongue in the pure chacha drink. Come! Well, on second thought, don't really think she's going anywhere. So maybe I'll just do all that myself then. is the capital of Georgia. Now because it's situated bam smack in the middle of the Silk Road on the way from China to Europe, the city has actually been conquered, destroyed and rebuilt 29 times. However, nor the Byzantine, nor the Mongols, nor the Turks, nor any other rebel could destroy the lyrical, luscious culinary tradition that's known as the remarkable Georgian cuisine we know today. We're going deep. I have 24 hours to eat like a Georgian. Now I want to be Georgian during breakfast, lunch, dinner, and even a midnight snack. But I want to do it my way, with the simple people in the streets where it's at. Well, Georgians like to take their time in the morning. I mean, it's 10 o'clock and things are only starting to warm up. And as a Georgian for one day, I'll start my day like any Georgian does, with some khachapuri. Hello. Did you make some khachapuri here? Yes? Perfect. I'm Ishai. Nice to meet you. Wow! This is beautiful. It's like old fashioned bakery. Actually, <laughs> Wrapping it up like a little baby in its cradle. I got the the most Uh huh. Cut off the extras. All right. Oh, beautiful. So they really mix the pastry and the cheese together. Uh huh. Again and again and again. I must doubt it. Okay. Now I just stick it in there. It's stuck. Mine's guy. Yeah? Thank you. My first khachapuri. Since when is this uh, recipe of the khachapuri? Khachapuri. Khachapuri arsebops so I do it. That's puri arsebops. Chinese cook and she misses the arsebops khachapuri. Yes, khachapuri does this now. See, puri da khoelishi. Khachapuri. Hachapuri, Hachapuri, Hachapuri. Thank you very much. <laughs> Cheese is a key ingredient in Georgian cuisine, but people here mostly make it at home for their own personal use. 
That's why when you walk the streets of Tbilisi, you will find none but one cheese shop in the whole city. And that's where we'll learn everything we want to know about Georgian cheese. Hello, how many cheeses do you have here? Till the last years, we have uh, only four cheese. But today, we have six zero cheese. 60 cheeses? Yes. In four years, you've expanded. Yes. Wow, that's really exciting. Yes. So let's eat some cheese then. Of course. Perfect. And now, get down. So what would be the first cheese that you'd like me to taste? This one is very tasty and very really famous cheese. Mmm, what's inside? Peppermint. Peppermint? Yes. Wow, cheese with peppermint inside. It's fantastic, very yes. nice. So here we have cheese with nuts, what's it called? It's a sulguri um, with nuts. Wow. Now I want to understand, why was it so important for you to develop these cheeses? Because I was really angry about only four cheese. We are very old, ancient countries. Yeah, we, have, we have ancient tradition foods. And uh -huh. I, I have a question, why you have only four cheese? Why we have not five, 10, 15, 20? So what, you actually went village by village yes, and started yes. to research Mount the by cheese. mount, village by village. What would be the strangest cheese that you've discovered on your travels? Uh, with, uh, oh my God! With, uh, it's an alien! This and um, potoli. So what do we have here? We have vine leaves. Yes. And um, grapes. Grapes. Yes. This cheese can stay uh, six months, 18 months, one year, and more than one, one year. My God. By this, he helps. The vine leaves makes the oldest contains cheese. it and, and yes, 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 yes. matures it. It's just like wine. Yes, yes, yes. So I want to thank you very, very much, Anna. It was great. It was a pleasure. Thank you so much. And thank you, Manana, very much. It was so interesting. And uh, I'll be on my way. It's lunchtime. And here in Tbilisi, the one thing the Georgians cannot do without must definitely be khinkali. Hello. Hello. I'm interested in Khinkali. I thought maybe you could help me. I heard this is the right place. Thank you. My name is Ishai. What's your name? Nanuli. 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 Nanuli will teach me to make Khinkali. That's great. So how do we start then? Gotcha. So what do we have in the meat? Akari sakonlis khortsi. Gavat arab sakonlis khorts. Ushrebit tsotam tsvanils. Ushrebit marils. Ushrebit tsitsakas. Tsitsals. Maybe I'm a spat helep tasse. Give it a roll. As a bat helep. We get mere akedan etik ozi. Take a spoonful. Uh -huh. This is the difficult part, isn't it? Accept uh -huh. it. Wow. Like a work of art, isn't it? Can I try? You take the dough. You splash it on the thing. You spread it out a bit. Okay, and then we start doing this thing, and this thing, and this thing, and this thing. Ah, as if I was born in Tbilisi. Cut off the head. Okay. Very nice. So what's next? Shem te gamas khrit tsqalshi, marilian tsqalshi, esari kvabi, dux tsqali, gurev tjokhit marilian tsqalshi, ase. So, this spoon, this is the most ancient spoon I've ever seen in my life. It's not just a spoon, it's a, it's a spear. And there you go. And how long do we wait? Seven minutes, and we're done. Five, four, three, two, one. I think it's ready. 
they look like little squids. Very nice. How they slide so gently into the plate. This is this one's mine. Oh, Esaris. Oh. Ah, this one's mine. Oh. And this one's yours. You would never tell the difference, would you? So how about you eat mine and I'll eat yours? I repped as a mock adept Kutsi Hells. I could say Hells as a Kinkal set of Heli teach me what's very burrat. Yeah, mock adept Hells does a chef janta. Ah, and you can drink the juice inside. Mmm, oh, Nanuli, Nanuli, the Kinkal is great. Wow. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Before I go, I want to uh, take a picture of this for my uh, for my blog. Could you take? Could you photo us together? Now say Khinkali. Khinkali. The largest river in Georgia, the Mitkvali River, crosses through Tbilisi and is crossed by a numerous number of bridges. Among them, the Dry Bridge, which houses the flea market. And here, you can literally find anything you want. What is this? Wine. Oh my god. What's John Jolie? Mm. <laughs> ah, it's really good. Can I have some? Thank you very much. Pereski, pereski. Pereski. I'll have one. Potato pereski. Here we go. Absolutely divine. Tamuna, is that you? Hi, hey, how are you? Very good. How are you? I'm fine, how are you? I'm very good. I'm, I'm so happy to see you I'm here. I'm happy to be here. We are waiting for a lot of guests today. Okay. I have to buy something for this dinner. Can you help me? Yes. Okay. What do we start with then? Uh, we must start with nuts. Yeah. I think it looks nice. What do you think? Did you taste it? Yes, of course. Taste okay. It. Tastes good. Mm. What do we need nuts for? Mm, for everything. We use it with uh, vegetables, we use uh, to make some sauces with it. Uh -huh. and so we eat it with meat as well. A lot so you put the nuts in everything? Yes, in oh, everything. Yeah, yeah. These Georgians are really getting nuts, aren't they? What are it's these uh, bracelets I see everywhere? This is Chochala. This is the Chochala? Yes. Really? Yes, really, and it's very, very tasty. And this, what? this is yes, the Chuchkala too? Yes, this is also Chuchkala. It's with uh, hazelnut and this is with what? normal nuts, okay? Okay. And with uh, well, grape the juice hazelnuts? and sugar. And that's all, but it's so okay. tasty. Do you want to taste no, I it? I never, I'd love to okay. taste it. Yes, great. How do you eat it? You just eat it? Just a second. Oh, what, what's this You thing? don't need to eat it. <laughs> it's a string? Yes. Wait, I'll just cut off a piece. So. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm, yummy. It's, it's a sweet, it's nice. Yeah, it's sweet. It um, looks like sausage, yeah? Yeah, I thought, it was, <laughs> yeah. I thought there were sausages so everywhere so and um, so I didn't understand why there's no smell. And here are our hazelnuts inside. Ah, with the chestnut. Thank you very, very much. Did you might love enough on this? So what's next then? Next, spices. We have to spices. buy spices. Spices okay. is also something very, very important in Georgian food. Well, I can't wait. This market is so much fun. Yes, I know. Here. What spices do you want then? We need this one. This is zafran, you know. Zafran? But it's usually red, isn't it? Yes, but in Georgia it's so yellow. <laughs> in Georgia it's yellow. <laughs> okay, we have to buy this coriander. Coriander? Yes. Perfect. What do you use the coriander for? Mm, uh, for the sauces 
and we use this with vegetables as well. It's very, very tasty. Okay, so let's okay. pack up our spices. Yes. And let's go eat. Yes. All right. Let's, let's go. go. I want to take a few pictures for my personal blog ah. so that I'll remember the market yes. at Tbilisi. Fine. Maybe you could help me. Could you could you hold this for a minute? In, so here we are in the market of Tbilisi, just before dinner with your yes. family, which I know it's going to be fantastic. Yes, of course. And I learned a lot of new stuff here. George Khala. 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 Here? Okay, yes. Thank you. Hi. Hello. Hello. Michael. Nice to meet you. Hello. We brought you some church chala. Well, that's a gift. Oh. It's a sweet Thank gift. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank Hi. Good evening. Oh. How are you? Oh. Hi. Hello. Nice to meet you. Hello. What's your name? Tina. Tina. Hello. Ketino. Yes. Ketino. And you? Nani. Nani. Hello. <laughs> Is that you? Yes. What? Can you still do that? <laughs> I have to say, the table looks amazing, outstanding. It's built yes. so rich. So what would we start with? This is your with? food. Uh, yes, I, this is, um, it's overwhelming. That's how cocktail looks. Mr. Thomas he is our yeah. tamada. He is the very important person on the table. He drank uh, with this um, horn. horn, yes. yes. And now he passed this to his friend, and he will drink uh, drink it as well. And this so will pass to beans. you. Okay, you can drink as much as you want. Okay. okay. <laughs> Good health, happiness, and to this wonderful family. Thanks. Okay. One gurgling horn down the hatch. Georgian dancing teacher. Well, it's um, 7.40 something in the morning. Now, the most brilliant invention that the Georgians ever had must definitely be the khashi, which is a soup that remarkably cures you from hangover. It can only be found in special places called sakhashi, and they're open only in the early morning. Now, if it works for the Georgians, well, I hope it'll work for me too. Excuse me, sir. Do you know where the nearest Sakashi place is? Right. Hello. Hi. Hi. 
I've heard a lot about the uh, hashi. Okay, wow, it's hashi. And I think I'm in deep need of some good hashi. Do you think I could uh, maybe see how it's made? Perfect. Wow, this place is great. Yes. Uh, yeah, but, but I've been drinking all all night. Then, well, okay, one more. Why not? Okay, sure. Yes. My mom always yeah. said, "Be brave, my son. Be brave." Right. Cheers. So this is the stomach? Oh, all right, all right, here you go. Cut this. Ah, it's nice and easy. All right, so we cut up the stomach, put it in here. What is in the khashi that helps for hangover then? Uh-huh. So do you think I could have some khashi now? Oh, wonderful. You're a god saver. Our problems are soon to be over. Well, I got my khashi. All that's left now is put a spoonful of garlic, a real bowl of health and energy. I've got the streets of old Tbilisi behind me. A wonderful future before me, and before I know it, I'll be back on my feet. Mm. Remarkable. I feel much better already. Well, I feel great now. Back on my feet. Let's go.